welcome, welcome to Jermaine All Natural. I am Jermaine Ryan, and in this video, time to go ahead and shave. Let's go ahead and break in the new bevel razor that I got, and you would have seen that in my Black Friday Cyber Monday haul bounty video. I'm gonna go ahead, break this bad boy open, now, I did not get the entire kit that comes with the brush, the little bowl, and like all the other things. I did just the safety razor, and as I mentioned, I had a small bottle that I tried of the shaving cream, but when I ordered it during Black Friday, it came with a full-size bottle. Apparently, I also bought a trial of the Restoring Balm. Forgot that I even had it. I have my bowl of water here. <laughs> we know how me and bowls of water go. And I have my white towel to follow up with. I have a warm towel here since I've been talking to help just to soften the hair up a little bit more. So here's what it looks like when it comes out of the box. Very simple and clearly not preloaded with the blade. But this part unscrews and... All right, so this is where you place the blade. Ah, comes apart. And here you have a bevel safety system blade. And then you also have uh, what looks like the instruction booklet. So it says, first page, before you start, always hold your razor at about a 30 degree angle. Here's how you do it. Grab your bevel razor and hold the logo on the on the head of the razor against your skin. Then it says, start tilting the blade and start tilting the handle until the, bl until the blade just touches your skin. Do not apply pressure. Be easy. That's close enough. And that's your 30 degree angle. So we'll try it again once I actually put the blade in it so we can see how it feels when I start to lower it. From here, um, <clears throat> you know, instructions on how to, say, how to shave. So as I said in the previous video and just from everything that I've looked up, is that you are supposed to shave with the grain of your hair. Now, I've been using blades for very long, 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 six years or so. So my skin should not hopefully have irritations when it comes to using a blade. I, I'm gonna guess a blade is a blade is a blade. I guess. Wait, are these blades? They feel so, they're bendy. So there are five of them that came in the little box. Yes, so very thin. Very thin blades, if you can see that there. So it's not quite the razor blade that I thought it was going to be. Here's our head. And we're going to I'm not sure if you can see it well at all or not. And then we're going to take the bottom place that over and then take our handle it says you're supposed to hold these two like so and then screw the handle so then it gives you directions on you know before you shave how to um, open up the pores how to soften the hair I did do an exfoliation on my skin to help raise the hairs so let's <laughs> And so immediately adding the shaving cream. <clears throat> so it says take a nickel size amount because I'm doing it with my fingers. I'm just going to do a splump. That's all I'm going to do. And y'all see that leather? That is a good lather. It says you're supposed to hold it against your face. Let it go down until you start to feel the blade. I think that's it there. And apply no pressure. I don't know if it did anything. Emblem. 
face. And I've got the instruction book right here. All right. Start tilting the handle until the blade just touches your skin. I'm not getting the blade. This is the under part that I keep getting. The blade isn't touching. What the hell? Maybe this blade is defective. All right, let's try it again because it wasn't working. So here, hold it until you can feel the blade. Oh, there it is, I think. Now, according to the video, say a one inch passes. Ooh. Wait, can y'all see that? I think I might need to bring y'all in closer. Hold on. Okay, that is uh, quite smooth. Quite smooth indeed, precious. Let's add more water and a little bit more cream. Okay, so wipe everything off, and I must say that is uh, quite the close shave, indeed. Okay, so what I'm going to do, because it takes, I, I don't want to cut my face. <laughs> and I really, really don't want to, you know, have my face be a potato and this blade be the potato pillar and I end up looking like a french fry afterwards. I don't want it. I don't want it. So that was the example that I'm going to do on camera. I have to go to my bathroom and do this in the bathroom mirror so that I can make sure that I'm doing this correctly, accurately, and getting the best shave. So I'll come back once I finish the this side here and everything underneath. I'll be back. Okay. I absolutely did what it said not to do, and I ended up getting a nick over here. And I start tilting it a little bit more, and I clearly went past 30 degrees, and nick, right there. Nick, and then there's one over here. Nick over here, so, can't have nothing. You give them an inch, they swim all over you. I'm gonna go ahead and reply the restoring bomb just a little bit. There, it says that this alcohol-free aftershave moisten, moistens and soothes the skin while helping to prevent bumps and irritation. It has a very menthol-y type of smell. Very Vicks Vapor Rubby. I am now beveled shaved. It is very, very close. Very, very soft skin. Hold on, let me bring you in closer. Very, very soft and smooth very very smooth let me move you back out so on my next go around i will not get greedy i will not tilt it beyond the 30 degrees like it was you know better than you know the little throwaway blades overall i definitely liked the bevel I believe that based off of everything that it said that it was gonna do, as far as giving a nice easy shave that is gonna cut the hair at skin level, I got a really close shave off of this. A really, really, I need to stop touching my skin. A really close shave off of it, just with the first pass. The second pass was just me f not being used to using a single blade and wanting to get closer, which is also why I ended up with the NYX here. But, you know, as I get used to it more, I think that the the first swipe will more than likely be good enough. Um, I, I think that it did that as well. And also, um, helping to reduce tugging and pulling, it was very effortless. But I think that goes into that 30 degree angle and just the weight of it where it just 
slices of off just effortlessly cuts through the hair so according to everything here that it says that it was going to do help do or reduce i definitely think that it did it definitely an investment i like it though i, I definitely like it first time using it first impressions I would recommend it. Let me know in the comments if you have used the Bevel Shave System, the safety razor, and also maybe if you have the entire kit, like with the brush and everything like that, let me know in the comments below if you've used the whole kit or just this, how well it worked for you. You know, did you have a hard time ad adjusting to a single blade and how did your skin react to it? Make sure you like, make sure you comment, make sure you subscribe, punch the notification button to keep up with when I release videos. I will see you in the next one. Bye.